Well, U.S. Treasury bonds maintain a bid today, uh, yields lower uh, on supply and also data points around the world. Uh, trading range about two and a half basis points and definitely uh, biased to the bid side. Data points, uh, import prices disappointed for May, uh, almost as expected to disappoint, but now down one and a half percent year on year. Uh, although most people would say that is consistent with the strength in the dollar and also the weakening oil price that we saw uh, in May. Funny, but there was a little bit of a knee-jerk reaction after both uh, numbers came out. However, trading seemed to take a whole different uh, personality than looking too deeply into the numbers. Uh, beyond that, um, we had agricultural exports hit a three-year low. That did bother the market uh, ever so slightly, but since has recovered. Um, and going forward, we had a supply number come out today. That was something that was very uh, well anticipated. People just wondering, given uh, Treasury bonds trading at uh, such a close proximity to the local, uh, local low, uh, what would happen? Well, uh, the auction actually came out really well. It was solid. Uh, with non-dealer bidding came out at 75.9%. Uh, That's above the average of 74.7. Uh, and also the bid to cover ratio came out a little bit better than expected, 232 times versus a 229 average. So that said, uh, given you know, the proximity to the local uh, low right now, 30-year uh, treasury bonds tend to be uh, slow on the close, awaiting new data points and expecting uh, you know, the next trajectory to come soon. Uh, traders seem to be squaring positions, uh, worried a little bit about overnight tweets and also data points we have coming up tomorrow with Chinese economic data.